I examine this. It doesn't have the stone on it. Have you put the yellow eye in the lion yet? You mean the tiger? Because I think that's where I got the MO disc. Unless there's a lion that I don't know about. But when I put the... I think when I put the blue eye in the tiger, it gave me shotgun shells, but then I put the yellow one in and I got this MO disc. I have these two medals. I think... Eagle of South, Wolf of North. I tried combining the stone and metal with the metal. I tried seeing if there's an arbitrary button. We even returned to Lisa Trevor's cabin. Not sure what to do. This is all we've been doing for, I think, like an hour and a half. Have you gotten the battery yet? Yes, I, I used it on a, an elevator in the courtyard. And went into the caves. No. I didn't go into the caves. Um, when I put the battery in, the elevator just went up. Like, it opened a shortcut. And I was thinking, wait, this sh I feel like it should go down. But it didn't. Okay. I will do that. But I'm really confused, how... How do I do that, though? Unless, maybe I put the battery in the wrong place? You know what? I wonder if you have to investigate the battery after you put it in. And then it's like, do you want to reverse the charge or something? What if it's like that? Maybe. Use the crank? Oh. Really? Okay, that's... That's interesting. Um... That is interesting. How? How in the bloody heck was I supposed to know that you're supposed to reverse the flow? I am so confused. <laughs> that was that seems like something that they didn't really document. Huh. Go down the elevator that you power with the battery, and then the cave entrance will be open. Okay. Now let's just get to where we were at. That's right. Go to the other side of the place. 
There's a waterfall that blocks the cave entrance when you raise the dam wall. So you needed to use the battery to power the elevator to create a second route down so that you can close the dam wall back up and stop the waterfall. Wow, that is interesting. I, I always saw the waterfall. I just thought, oh, it's, it's a beautiful waterfall. There's nothing else to it. <laughs> but nah. <laughs> There's more to it than that. Okay, we'll do that then. I believe if you, were, if you were to examine the waterfall, it says something about seeing a cave through the water. Might be wrong though. Yeah, probably. I think it does say that. Jeez. Okay. I feel so stupid. Like, I'm pondering downloading the stream and excising pretty much that entire hour and a half. I don't think you're wrong. That would suck if I brought the wrong object. Okay, I'm trying to think. I think the double door is where the courtyard is. Yeah. Okay. So as far as where we put the crank in, I think that goes here. Can you hear the game sound, by the way? Because I fixed some things. Game sound is good, yes, good. I don't really remember, really remember if or how the game points out, points you to the solution. It's been way too long since I actually thought about how you actually solve anything. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. Cool. Alrighty. I was running into that door a little too much, I think. Ow. Where SB is. Ishmael's on the couch, but where is the queen? Okay. I'm worried. <laughs> The caves right here. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. Yes. <laughs> oh no. I don't like it. Oh, court. Okay. Hey, item box. Really? Heck yeah. <gasps> yes, dude. Yes. Okay. Let's get this. Um, I think I am aware of something that happens down here. Couple things. Couple things. I also, I think I need to start 
mixing herbs. Not mixing blue and green ones, I think that's excessive, but... Uh, yeah. Don't worry, Lisa totally doesn't want these caves. You'll be fine. Thank you, man. That makes me feel a lot better, actually. Thank you. Alright. Then I'll... I'll try not to get too spooked. Okay. Try not to get too anxious, because obviously we don't have anything to worry about, do we? Uh, did I miss it already? No. Okay, good. <laughs> right. What's this? There's a hexagonal hole here. Oh, good. Need another crank. I'm guessing. Not that I've ever heard of a hexagonal crank before in my life. I mean, honestly, Lisa Trevor has a nice place. A, a quaint little cabin. And what a great little cave system to run around in. She's just living her best basilisk from Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets life. That's all. You don't even have to worry about it. There's a round lid. Open it. No! I don't want to get ambushed. There's something shiny over here. What's this? Oh, oh, wait, there was something shiny. What is this? What are you? Yes. I will take the handgun bullets. What's this? Oh, good. So much. So much stuff. I was talking uh, earlier about how I think we're finally near the end, but then that hour and a half open, and it's like, eh. Will you take the shaft? Yes. Let's examine it. Okay, four, two, three, one. Alright, is there anything special with that? Or Okay, maybe... gonna just leave that there for right now. Huge gaping hole. Wonder what it was dug for. You can leave the shaft, saves inventory. Thank you. It sounds like I'm starting to get a little bit of the hang of inventory management, even though I don't think the holding two weapons and two kinds of ammo thing is gonna fly with Chris's story. <laughs> or with, with any harder difficulty, I should say. Is that you, Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Yeah. You're alive! Stop! Enrico. Are you with anybody, Jill? No, but why? <sighs> the stars are finished. Someone is a traitor. Umbrella set us up. Enrico. On Raider? Who? Why is she surprised about this? We read a document saying that the stars were sent here as for an ambush. <gasps> What's between his legs? Is that a crank? Wait. Yeah, exactly. He's holding something. Yes! 
Good job, Jill. Proud of you. <laughs> oh boy. I never thought I would ah! make it this far in the game. Jill reacted to that gunshot so nonchalantly. You know, there was another time in the game where I felt like she was pretty nonchalant about her reaction. Or maybe I'm thinking of a different game. I'm not sure. There's some game that I was either playing or looking at recently where they, the reaction was so non-existent. I'll take it. Give me them bullets. So yeah, on the higher... No, no, I did actually mean on Chris's game. He has six inventory slots. Effectively, the way I've been playing two weapons and two ammo types, too much, I would say. I was going to ask you, what are hunters exactly? Are they genetically modified frogs? Alligators? <sighs> oh, hey, what's up? Nothing. Never mind. I thought something. I thought something was gonna happen. Something of an Indiana Jones type. Okay, where are my acid shells? I need to do management of this item box eventually. Excuse me. Oh, it's loaded with all of the acid shells. Okay. I gotcha. We'll just put that there then. Also keep that. Oh, let's also combine this. Hunters are humans spliced with reptile DNA and, of course, a dash of T-virus. Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, let's go ahead. Um, that is interesting. Oh, I just found out uh, in the game, Tyrant Virus. I guess that's what T stands for. I didn't know that. And I feel very excited, overwhelmed with gratitude at my intelligence. What is... Hey, what's up? A huge boulder blocks the way. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Wonder how it's going to get away, huh? Ugh. 
I was also thinking it's kind of weird. Her face looks just like... Her face and eyes look just like Jill Valentine from Resident Evil Remaster. But the outfit is from Resident Evil 5. And... I don't know, I just thought that was weird. It's like they... Wait, can we go back, or...? It's like, instead of putting her Resident Evil 5 model in, they put... Oh, whoops, wrong one. <laughs> they put her... They kept her regular model and then just put her in an outfit in Resident Evil 5. But when you pick the costume, it's a different kind of thing going on. So I don't know what to say. When you pick the costume, it's like you're playing with Resident Evil 5, Jill. Hello, mister. Actually, just... Uh, I know... I know what I'm supposed to do. But I don't trust myself to do it. I think I should probably try and kill him. Because I'm sure there's an achievement. That's Black Tiger, right? Ooh, is this the map? <gasps> yes. I will gladly take that map. Thank you. How sweet of them. Okay. Um... No. Excuse me? That's a green herb, you... What? Oh! Wait, I am so... Con okay, whatever. Combine. I don't think I should waste my ammo on him. At least this ammo. I feel like I should waste my... My grenade launcher ammo... On the spider boy. he's a boss, and I assume that bosses are just more powerful. They take more bullets. What's this? Oh! Well, fans... Wait, have we been here? <laughs> I don't think we've been here. I thought that we had, but... Oh! Interesting. Going here. Gotcha. Wait, there. Did we investigate this? Is there anything? No. Okay. Thought maybe there was something to investigate. Okay, we're gonna go through here. We're gonna run uh, back to our item box, get our grenade launcher, destroy these spider hoes. I had a question. If I put my... If I put... Okay. If I shoot off rounds, like acid rounds or something, 
and then I want to change ammo types, will it give me back the unused ammo? Or do I still... Am I stuck with that? Okay, I don't think we need this anymore. Um, we don't need that right now. You keep all your unused ammo. Okay. That makes me feel better. Let's use that. Okay. And let's equip this. We didn't equip it, did we? There we go. Alright. Let's go kill us some... Wait. Do you know what grenade ammo would be better for... The spider? Incendiary? Would that be better? Uh, we only have six, though. I don't know if we should use those. Hmm. save again. Like, a safety save. No clue on which grenade ammo would be best, but I can safely say that you have way more than enough of everything for the rest of the game, it seems. <laughs> that's, that's encouraging. I'm, I'm really happy to hear that. Um, okay, this is our safety save seat slot, I should say. I don't even know why I keep bouncing between these. Okay. Let's do it! Yeehaw! Fortune favors the bold! Oh, darn it, I was all excited. Okay, sorry. Here we go. Uh. Oh. Oh, we got some more shotgun. I forgot to put my ink ribbon back. I hate everything. That's spider door. You know what? Freaking do it. We're gonna murder these jerks. Okay, that's, you know? I, it's okay. It, you know, it's okay. Oh, hey, we got the other one. I mean, we got, okay, Spider Sense is the one we got just now. The achievement. Okay, cool. Oh, hey! Oh. All these squishy things. Oh, no! I'm poisoned! If only I had blue herbs to make it so I don't die of poison. I will take the survival knife. How cute. Oh, there's another one. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Ooh. I was really underestimating how bad the trajectory on this is. Oh boy. Ooh, dear. He's going after me. Okay. Uh, I realized that I just wasted a lot of ammo. So we're just gonna... We're just gonna do that. There we go. My bad. My bad. Okay. We good. I think. Okay. Can we squish these little guys? Oh, yeah. Squish them. That's right. Squish. Squish. Oh yeah. Oh, can I can I knife him? Ooh. 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 From this point I finished the rest of the game with 18ish shotgun shells, 18 magnum rounds and 22 handgun, I believe. Wow, that's that's good then. We are pretty set because you were also on a difficulty 2 up from here. 
right? You're on the... They call it normal, but I refuse to call it that. I call it hard. I don't like that very easy, easy, normal thing. That's... You were playing on hard mode. Get out of here. <laughs> I can't carry any more items. Why did I pick up that survival knife? That's right. Because I want to make sure that I have every item in the game. That's right. Okay. No, never mind. Put this in here. Um, that's right, we need... Oh! It's almost as if I saw the future. I was on normal, yeah, and I killed everything in the lab. The lab? I've never heard of that. Oh, jeez, I hope you didn't spoil the final level of the game where you probably fight a boss called the Tyrant. Oh, wow! One of my friends who hasn't been playing games at all just signed on to Borderlands 2. That's pretty cool. Okay, we'll put this in here. Uh, we might as well bring a first aid spray just in case. Okay! Oh, we should probably equip something. I don't like hunters. We're going to keep our shotgun out. Oh, man. The final level is Rainbow Road, and you fight Dr. Robotnik at the end with the help of Bubsy. Oh, jeez, dude. Why did you say that? It's like you don't have any respect for those of us that don't want to be spoiled of everything. Spoilers! Yeah. Yeah, no heck. Did we get everything in here? We did. Okay, cool. <sighs> okay. Oh, darn. I meant to put spoilers at the beginning. Well, you didn't. And now the damage is done. I just... I don't trust you. I don't trust you at all. Oh, uh, earlier Downright Base was in here. He was telling me that Onimusha is like Resident Evil but with samurai. Did you know that? <laughs> Cuz I I never knew that at all. And I find it funny because it's made by Capcom as well. Just like Dino Crisis, just like Resident Evil. for a second there. Oh, heck. I didn't know the DMC one is Resident Evil with a Demon Slayer dude, though. Yes. Because that is... Oh, man, I don't like this. Uh, yes. I mean, well, I knew that Devil May Cry was what... It was one of the iterations of Resident Evil 4 before we got Resident Evil 4. Like, it, it was one... It was, you know what I'm saying. We, yeah, we're, we're aware. Um... Okay. Hey. Oh, you can't use it now. Is that so? Is that so? Was it not on the right pixel for you, Capcom? Ah, it seems like that's what it was. How fascinating. Oh, wait. Should I try and crank it again? No! 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 Chill! Do you not know what damage you have done? 
What I'm wondering is how does this crank affect that thing over there? It's so weird. Devil May Cry 1 plays very much like old school Resident Evil. It's pretty weird. It does, it sounds weird, honestly. Um, I know I've played a little bit of it. I've played a little bit of it. But I haven't played enough. To say, oh yeah, I knew that. All I can think of when I keep running on this thing is it's like when a cat jumps onto a Roomba when it's still spinning. <laughs> it's, it's really cute. Um, hmm. Now this puzzle is interesting. I have literally no idea. But don't tell me yet. Because I think... I want to figure it out. Oh yeah, I uh, I got the V jolt. I don't know if I told you that. I got the V jolt, and it was like the most satisfying. Oh, oh, I get it. <clears throat> okay, it was like the most satisfying puzzle in the entire game for me. Making that V jolt, it was so satisfying. Oh, I loved it. It was so cool. Like, writing down the numbers and figuring out, hypothesizing rather, and then confirming what you're supposed to do with the numbers. Oh, so cool. So cool. Wait. Wait. I love the V-Jolt puzzle. You can't do it in Chris's game, though, it seems. Are you serious? That's awful. Why wouldn't they let you do that in Chris's game? Okay. So we just put it back here, right? <laughs> Ugh. Wait, no, that works. I think. I mean, we'll see if it works. <laughs> That's so weird. Why wouldn't they let you do that? <clears throat> I mean, I guess... I know that the stories are slightly different, but... I didn't think it was that different. How do you... Dif eh, never mind. Maybe, I'll, maybe I'll figure it out later. Okay. I was very proud, and now I'm not. Did I try pushing it into the wall at all? Or... Yeah, I did. Hmm. hmm. I thought it was interesting in, uh... Oh wait, I never investigated this. What does it say? <laughs> In the medical storeroom, it doesn't say anything. Okay. It says that the bed has been used recently, I think. And...
I just thought that was interesting. I was thinking maybe that was like a reference to like Chris Redfield or something. Chris Redfield had used it recently because I know that in his story, Rebecca's in there and And Chris is obviously in there because it's a, uh, you know, it's Chris's story. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. Have I been overthinking this? We just have to shove him in, like, this way? No. I don't think so. Wait. Excuse me. I did have it in there, didn't I? Oh my gosh. Okay, so that thing I'm I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Did I just not have it situated correctly or something? Okay. <clears throat> I wonder if it would be a good idea. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see. If I could... Push her against the wall again. And then put it here. Pretty sure that's too far. I was thinking of trying out Dino Crisis again now that I'm in like a Resident Evil mood, but I I don't know if that's a good idea. Okay. There you go. No. Okay, I guess there you don't go. Oh, there you go. <gasps> what is this? Duct tape! Yes. I will take the cylinder. Thank you. Oh, and then we just add it to the cylinder. The, the shaft, I should say. We, sh we add it to the shaft, I think. I think that's all we need to do, right? Map. Still something in this hallway? But but where? Oh, hey, what's the Oh hey, you shouldn't have. Now I didn't know that these all come with different kinds of herb mixes. Or items as it were. Which was interesting to me. I, I had no idea. We're almost 100% items down here. That's awesome. Okay, I shouldn't say almost 100% items. We have quite a while to go, I would say. We're getting there. We are getting there. We're definitely not going to beat this game tonight. We're 
We're getting there. Let's see anything in here? Yes, there is something in this hallway. Oh, there's a there's an herb here, isn't there? Oh, there one herb. Okay. That's what I was getting mixed up on. I thought it looks like there are two herbs right there for me, but there's only one. Like a yellow card song. I was looking into the side, not side games, unlockable games, game modes in the in this game, and I don't know, invisible enemy mode just sounds too ridiculous for me. But I've said it before. I know. I, I realize that it's it's not meant for people to play on their first time through. It's meant for. There's a reason you have to play the game. You have to beat the game many many times in order to uh, unlock it. Let's see, first aid spray. Sure. No, not that one. This one. 38 saves. I think we've saved six times since starting the stream, which is a lot. Okay, what do we have? We got all that. You know... I feel like I need healing items. So we're going to bring a first aid spray again, just in case. Because I feel like we're going to be going down, down, sugar, we're going down swinging. Uh, summon, 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 uh, 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 <laughs> Treasures? Yes! Oh, items. <clears throat> okay. I don't know why I've ca been calling them treasures this whole time. Maybe I've been watching too much Resident Evil 4, because I know it's referred to as treasures in that game. Or treasure. Anything else over here? We're going the wrong way. I know that. Okay. Um, you know, I might as well get this final item or two. If we're able to, I don't know. I, have we been in this room before? Let's see. Sorry, I keep checking the map. I, I do not know the caves as well as I know the mansion. Gosh, that's, just, that's so sad to hear that Chris is story, you're not able to do that. It's so sad. Okay. We will take that. Thank you. Is that all of them? Good. We did it. For this part. I was watching a video earlier today, a review of like the uh, Legacy of Goku trilogy, and 
It was really disappointing because you could kind of see how bad that first game was. Which I never knew back in the day. I thought it was so fun, but I never played it more than a couple times. But it seems like it just gets worse from there. Uh, wait. Again. Wrong way. Why am I going this way? I, okay, so the first game looks really bad. The second game looks like it takes what the first game was trying to do and does it a bit better. And then the third game is... Okay, I guess? Pretty good. Um, Legacy of Goku? Yeah, it was like uh, the Game Boy Advance games. They're top, not top-down necessarily, but sort of top-down RPGs. I don't... I don't know how to explain them other than that. They're, they're not too deep, but I don't know how else to, s to explain it. <laughs> uh... Oh, okay, good. Um... There we go. This is where we're supposed to be, right? Yeah, okay. I would like to take the shaft, thank you. That sounds familiar, I think I love those games. Uh oh. Oh no, I don't want to press one. Oh jeez. Okay. Oh! Pfft, duh! Jeez. Okay. We already know the code. I'm so dumb. Okay, it's, uh, let's see. Salmon 4, 2, 3, 1. There you go. Jeez. There's an empty place for the cylinder shaft. Something seems to be missing. Really? Okay. Four. Two. Three. One. Uh, boy, I can't wait to see where this goes. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> this is so fun. Oh, Chris, I can't wait. <laughs> Barry? Thank God you're safe. You too, Jill. A noise I heard brought me down here, but I didn't expect to find a place like this. A noise you heard in a cave system. I just don't see how Any that works. Any idea as to what might be at the bottom? There's only one way to Isn't find Isn't cave... Out. Aren't cave systems where, like, people... Like, noise goes to die? I just, I don't know. I'd like to know where you were before this, Barry. Be very suspicious, Barry. Uh -oh. What the hell is that sound? It could be a person. Jill, go check it out. We had enough surprises for one day. I'll stay here and secure our escape route in case something happens. Okay. Barry... This whole splitting up thing is not working. I think... You're... Uh, I just think you're being a douchebag. That's all. I'm sorry. I have to come out and say it. You're being a real... You're being a real George Lucas. Circa Phantom Menace 1999. Get 
out of my way, Barry. I don't want to talk to you, Barry. Okay, um... Do I need the crank anymore? Or can I open up a slot to do something? Also, I wonder if I should get bigger bullets, because I, I think I know what to do. And it helps when you have Barry with you, but I don't know what else to do. Like, I know the main thing, but I don't know everything, you know? I don't want to waste my magnum rounds. That sounds stupid. I don't want to do that. Guess we could do that. Just for fun. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. What's this? Ah, it wasn't an invitation, Jill. It wasn't an invitation, my friend. What is this? Garbage compactor. No. Oh, maybe I have to push something into it. Like myself. Is there anything down here? I'm not... I'm not seeing anything down here. Huh. I wonder what the purpose of this is. Surely we wouldn't be leading any person down under that compactor and then hitting that button, right? That would never happen. This game is too kind for that. What was that? Oh dear! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I wish I was a fish. But I don't have anything else to say! There's a there's a box here. Is Lisa Trevor inside of this box, perhaps? I think that would be really silly. I didn't know that you would meet Lisa Trevor outside of uh, another boss battle. That's interesting. Not that not that we ever have a boss battle, but uh, okay. Can I now can I press this while I'm on it? Okay. 
Oh gosh, dang it, jerk! Oh man, hey, can you not though? Oh good! Trevor, you are such a little business. I think you should die. I don't like you one bit. Cause you're a bit. Barry! <gasps> oh, this son of a biz. Okay, um, Barry, what is your problem? I feel like you're guiding me into my death. Can you confirm or deny these allegations, dude? Okay, we have some, we have some first aid sprays, that's good. Got a lot of those, actually. But we're not going to use them. I think we're going to just bring out our herbs a little bit more. Uh. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna use up another green herb here because I just I just don't trust myself. Uh, we're gonna also combine this. There we go, we're gonna go down here, we're gonna see if that box made his epic journey to the trash compactor. He has. He has, everybody. And now, uh, I don't know what the purpose of this is, but we will push it <laughs> into the trash compactor. How's that sound? Oh, you know what? I bet when you crush it, it's gonna give you something to put in those little handle thingies. And then when you put something in those handle thingies, you're able to open that door, and then you get to fight nothing because Lisa Trevor will be done for already. We're never gonna fight her. Ever. Again. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> This is a flamethrower. Oh, it's a broken one, though. That's okay. It makes me feel better about actually having the thingamahoochie. You know, I'm gonna just... Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back up. Obviously, we need to go back up anyways. We're gonna go in the item box. We're gonna replace the mixer we have with a first aid spray because, if you notice, we actually got down to danger, I think, for the first time in the entire game, and I don't want to deal with that right now. So we're gonna get a first aid spray right now. Okay, we're good. By my count, she can hit us twice before we go into danger mode. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna try and find where that little clip thingy was. I don't know where it was. It showed the cutscene of the things popping out. It didn't show us exactly where. Go on this way. It's the No, that's not the that's a different door. Great, now she's probably gonna spawn closer to us. I thought we had We had done th something <laughs> I thought we had done something good for one. Okay, you are just a bitch. I'm sorry, dude. You're just a freaking... I hate you. Wow, can you not scream at me, please? Can you just, like, literally not, though? 
I'm not in the mood for your screaming, Lisa Trevor. Yeah, I know. Ugh. Yeah, shut up. Oh my gosh, we're not making any progress, are we? Okay, there we go. Okay, this is a good place to go, I think. Okay, we're lost. We're so lost right now, it's not even funny. I can't even find where that other door is. Wait. Oh, go down here. Oh, that's right. Okay, go up here. And then this way. Right? And then this way. And then we're back again. Okay. I feel like I'm going insane. Okay. Do we go down this way at all? Did we go down this way? Oh my gosh, we did. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hey, let's uh now while we're here, why don't we just pick this stuff up, sure. Yeah, sure, let's pick this up. Ah, please, please leave, though. Please leave, though! Okay, uh, map? <laughs> please? Oh, if we keep going this way, we find it. Oh, my gosh, here we go! Holy crap, look at that! We actually used the map for once. Excuse me?! It's not useful, huh? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Ex excuse me. Yes, I know this. Now how the... Excuse me. What do you want me to do? What do you wish for me to do? Oh my gosh, we have to hit the thing again, don't we? Oh my god, I hate you. You're such a... <sighs> Shut up, Lisa Trevor. Thank you, Draineth, for the host. Okay, we got it. We got it, boys. We got it. Okay, let's check the map again. Let's see if we're going the right way. Okay, I think we're going the right way again. Oh, God, no. Okay, gotta put that in there, okay? And then we're gonna... Oh, gosh! You gotta open the door, Jill! Oh. Oh. oh, my gosh, thank you. Thank you, Drainus, seriously. That means a lot to me. Oh, okay, hey, this is creepy. We're... We're actually nearing the end of this game, I'm pretty sure. Sounds like... Seems like you're having a good time. Mm, is that so? <laughs> oh, good! Oh, no! No! These stupid snakes! <laughs> oh, yes, I will take that dagger, thank you. Can we uh, check if we have all the treasures? We don't? Okay, that's fine. We will just go up this ladder, and we're going to get mad at Barry for leaving us at the altar. Oh, okay, or not. I guess we're going to go somewhere else for a second. Dude, what... What even is happening right now? Oh! Look at all of this. Did we get poisoned at all? No. Good. Okay, that's very good. Uh, you know, I'm gonna take one of these herbs real quick. <clears throat> yeah, I am having a good time. I'm just very confused and scared. Frightened. You picked a good time to host me, I would say. Especially since this is the first time we've actually made any significant progress tonight. The first hour and a half of the stream was just running around not knowing where the heck to go. Hey, no, HP. Uh What? Excuse me?
Excuse me? Oh, wow. Interesting. Okay. Okay, so now it makes sense how she traverses between these places. Um, you know, we're going to put that in there and we're going to bring out another first aid spray just in case. Now, what do you expect me to do? What do you expect me to do, game? You expect me to save, don't you? Well, guess what? I'll save. I don't have any fear of saving. I have many fears, but not of that. Okay. Interesting. I was kind of wondering why there was a save spot and an item box in this particular area. Although now I'm I'm curious, what do we even do? Do we go back circle back around and meet Barry or something? Like, I don't know what to do. Oh, man, I don't like this. I do not like this one bit. Lisa Trevor. Why must you be so cool? I mean, I know that you were brought up with awful... Awful things happening to you, but... Jeez. You gotta lay off. Okay. Oh. I am in the Twilight Zone right now. No. There we go. Gosh. No, oh, you freak! Okay, anyways. Um keep going. I I swear I heard that the zombies in the forest don't turn to crimson heads. What I have heard is wrong. Maybe they fixed it in the the new version of the game. I don't know. Ugh. So drain it. How did your stream go? I forgot to ask that. <laughs> I saw. I, I think I saw you streaming, right? All right. No, I saw a tweet. I saw a tweet that you were streaming. But as fate would have it, I was. I was planning on starting my stream like 20 minutes after that, so... Sorry. <laughs> okay. Wrong door. Wrong door. Gotta go back. <clears throat> I gotta go this way. think. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. You know... No... Okay. Let's try to go to the... Courtyard. Oh, sorry. Wrong one. I was thinking maybe we should try and go to the mansion first to see if Barry has anything to say for being such a douchebag, but... Then I'm thinking maybe we should just double back around. Go back to Lisa Trevor's lair. I mean, I guess I could have just... No, no, I couldn't have. Because he brought the elevator. I was thinking I could have gone back around anyways, but he brought the elevator with him. Thus, we cannot go back the way we were coming from. And Draineth, have you ever played Resident Evil? I forget if you have. Is this the route to go? Yes. Yes, it is. I know that 
Miss Bashelface doesn't like horror games, but I can get what you thought about them. Let's see. I forgot. Barry? You... Oh, Barry. Can't trust him. Let's see if we got all the treasures? We did. Nice. Okay. Um... Hmm. Well then. Let's go back to the mansion. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Espy, bless you. Jeez, you scared the heck out of me, kid. You scared the heck out of me, Gooseables. Woo. Oh, thank you for the Gooseables. The kitty bath. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. So I think we are actually meant to go back to the mansion. Which would actually make sense! Because there's a door we are not able to open. And maybe, just maybe, that's how we get... That's how we get it open. We go back to the mansion after Barry betrays us. You can't spell betray without B A. R Y but like mixed up and obviously his name is B A R R Y but you you're killing the joke no reason to point out all the flaws in every joke I do all the little tiny flaws like have you no respect Oh yeah, okay, we did save. We saved at the mansion... thing. I, you know, I don't know. Probably could have not done that, but we did it anyways. Oh, I thought the door was open for some reason. That would have been creepy, but it wouldn't be out of the question. There are a lot of times nowadays when you go up to a hallway where there used to be a door and then there isn't one. Okay. Alright, we are going to save it again because I'm a hopeless romantic. Put that in. Put that in. Why would I put that in? No, don't put that in. Not yet. Okay. Here we go! I would like to save my progress. Can we hit 50 saves? Possibly. You never know! If we put our minds to it, we can do it. I can guarantee at least that much. Up. <laughs> um, bring that out and let's bring the other one out because I have a good feeling. I have a good feeling about this one. I feel like we're going to be Finally, getting that, that metal object fastened with a stone. And I, for one, cannot wait. Uh, 
I'm trying to think of the best way to get back to the Great Hall. Because that's what, I don't know, when, when Barry said something, he said, uh, if anything happens, let's meet up at the Great Hall. And he said that about, oh, you know, 20 hours ago, but maybe this is what he meant. He was leading to this moment in time. This moment in time when we would meet up. Okay, go down. Combine. <clears throat> okay, Barry, what are you doing? Okay, well, he's not here. Let's go behind the staircase. That's usually the way to do it. Nope. No, I won't take it. Oh, let's move this way, that's right. In speed runs, when you're told to look around the hallways or whatever, um, normally you would like run around, go up these stairs, etc., etc., but uh, in order to speed run it, you just go behind the staircase and that counts as it. Like, that's it, I guess. Uh, let's go to the dining hall? I might be ending the stream on a bit of a sour note, I'm sorry, I, I don't... I don't know... where to go. Wait. Oh! It's because the stone and metal object is in that door still, that's why it shows we still have treasure out there. In the foyer. The foyer. Let's see. Is he in the kitchen, maybe? Do you want a snack? If he's not here, which he's not, I think we're going to end the stream, and I'm sorry to everyone that came in here from Drainus Street. <laughs> but we probably... probably won't be streaming for too much longer. Um, I think we've done almost three hours. In fact, it might be literally exactly three hours, now that I look at that. Which is a pretty healthy stream. It's just a shame that, like, nothing happened in it. And again, I am sorry for that. I'm trying to think of where we're supposed to go. Were we told anything? That's the first place to look. <laughs> if we were told anything. But generally, we're not told anything. We're supposed to find documents, etc., etc. And we haven't found any of those recently. I was running! Sorry, crows! Sorry. Jeez. You're so loud. <laughs> okay, we might as well try to go through here, but we'll make sure not to run. That's the issue. Crows don't like it when you run. Little known fact. That was weird. It's almost like their their sound effects were oh gosh, that's that mirror reflection though. 
It almost sounded like the sound effect was doubling, then tripling. Okay. <clears throat> that was about the scariest walk I've ever done in the game. You might be saying, wait, what about the Lisa Trevor thing? Uh, that was me running. That was the scariest run I've ever had. Scariest... Scariest walk is different. <laughs> Why did I go back in here? Oh, because I think this is an easier way to get to our item box. Which it absolutely is. I think we just have to go down the hallway, take a left. Yep. Unless there's an enemy, but of course, I don't think there is. Okay. I'm going to do a daring thing where I actually don't save to end the stream. Hey.